If you like a little music with your football, we went to Westerville and Worthington for week nine of high school football. Yeah, both of these schools' marching bands, they're trying to claim that W before uh, football comes this Saturday night, even Friday night, that is. Even played as NBC4's Band of the Week. That's what they're trying to fight it out for tonight. Christine Barconi joining us with both these competitors. Yes, Mark and Darlene, this week, Thomas Worthington and Westerville Central High Schools welcomed me into their band practices for our second to last Band of the Week of the year. Football season winds down. The seniors at Westerville Central and Thomas Worthington are starting to reflect. I just want to um, appreciate it while I still can. Just soak up all the moments I can and try to enjoy it. And I would not have been able to do this if it wasn't for the amazing directors that we have in this district at high school and middle school. They're amazing. But they're still as competitive as ever. <laughs> Want to show off their halftime show to all of Central Ohio. Our show this year is incredible. We got a new arranger. Our closer is amazing. We're fun and we try to entertain people, and that's what we're here to do. In Worthington, there's some buzzworthy musical wordplay in their show. It features Overture to the Wasp, Flight of the Bumblebee, and Fields of Gold by Sting, which is the greatest pun to ever be made. <laughs> Westerville. So what I hear you say. Featuring some pop icons. So it's senior night for the marching band, and so the seniors picked and uh, selected a song for us to do. So we picked a Beyonce song, and we're also doing our, the rest of our modern hits show. All right, Central Ohio, we want to hear from you. Who do you think is worthy of the Band of the Week title? Go to NBC4I.com slash join right now. Pick Thomas Worthington or Westerville Central. We will be visiting the winning band during their football game tomorrow night to stream their entire halftime show. It will be on our website, app, and Facebook page. Be sure to vote right now for your favorite team, and we'll show you the results during the 6 p.m. newscast.